All right, we've already been through, if you haven't seen it, a video on continuity of the power cord. We tested one end versus the other. We had continuity from each, each female to each male on the other end that way. Now, the other end is plugged into the wall out of frame. So what we're going to do now is a second test on the power cord for voltage. So we set our voltage uh, meter to voltage AC. So it's V with the wavy line. Wavy line is AC. AC is what comes out of your wall everywhere. Okay? That's all you've got. So if you're testing anything, voltage that comes out of the wall, set your meter on wavy line and V for voltage. So AC is the wavy line. And what I want to take are my two leads. And we know this bottom one that's down by itself is the ground, so we're going to ignore that. And then we're going to plug our leads into the cord. Of course, it's plugged in out of frame, and you can see we've got 121 volts, which is plenty. Um, generally, these will range from probably 117 to 123. If you have anything below 115, um, that would be a little low, but probably your treadmill would still work. But this is a great way to test your power cord using voltage. Um, remember, before you do this test, always a good idea to test your outlet by plugging in like a household appliance, like a hair dryer, just to make sure the outlet is hot before you go to this trouble. And that's our power cord AC power test.